Happy Thursday. I am getting ready to go to my race. I am doing run Woodstock where there is no power, no running water, uh, so no showers. So I'll show you just what I've done with the van here so far. Yes, the bed is done out of sequence. Usually it's the floor, then the walls, then the ceiling. But because I have two races coming up, I need a bed. <laughs> I need a place to stay. So anyway, um, subfloor is done. Bed frame, don't worry about this. I didn't have time to cut plywood, so I just put the pieces I had in there to support the bed. This is inflating. This is a 8-inch um, memory foam. I will link down here. This is the second one I bought. I have one in the house, and I loved it so much. I said, this is going in Stanley, so I can be comfy. Um, so anyway, the metal prep, primer, stuff for the floor, then the insulation and the frame, plywood, uh, stain primer, um, the 2 by 4s for the bed, and the bed itself, the total so far for Stanley Build is $710.95. But now I'm going to go get Stanley an oil change and uh, get me some containers. I also, um, I guess I should include it in the build, but I bought a portable power station. So I will have electric in here. I also bought a portable camping shower so I can clean up after the race. And I also purchased a, um, um, what do you call it? Oh, geez. I am just like, <sighs> portable shower. Oh, stove. I have two. Uh, I've, I've had them for quite a while. I have two, um, propane stoves and I have one electric but we won't be having electric so the propane stove is going so now I'm going to go get some storage just temporary for under the bed um to put my gear and stuff in but I'm very excited this will be the first weekend with Stanley Woo! and I will also um I'll be filming all the race so that will be a separate video to come Woo! live fierce Woo!